everybody, it's Glenn back in this video with Blind Bag Bonanza. In fact, you join me back at Blind Bag Bonanza HQ, aka me sat in my living room. Yep, I like to pop myself in front of the camera every now and then just to prove contrary to my video reviews that I'm an actual human being and not just a video camera with a pair of human hands. In this episode, we're featuring a couple of Blind Bag Bonanza old faithfuls. These are one up box and also what I believe is T blocks. Yet it seems T blocks have run out of envelopes with their logo printed on them. I've also been contacted by Geek Fuel and have been sent their latest box. Which, if I'm honest, is kind of beginning to stroke my ego with all these companies contacting me. I must be pretty darn good at this unboxing nonsense, right? Either that or they know I'm the kind of idiot that just can't say no. But before we get into those, I've been sent this by Plush Moji.com hashtag plush moji. I was contacted by them because this is one of the fringe benefits of being a modestly successful YouTuber. They contacted me and was like, Glenn, hey, we'd love to send you a plush moji so you can show it off to your subscribers. And I was like, hell no. Then I saw they had a plush poop one and I was like, hell yeah. Now I just need a skull and an L. And just so I'm not just shilling this to you all, I'll um, put it to use in this video by sitting on it, which should be nice and comfortable and ease my piles. Oh yeah. Let's kick off with the new kid on the block, Geek Fuel. And I have to say, this is intriguingly heavier than most subscription boxes I receive. Perhaps it's a brick in there. Maybe it's full of sand. Only one way to find out, and that's to open it up. And to assist me with doing that, I have Mr. Stanley Knife. I'm Stanley. Stan, if you could please do the honors. What is this? Dino Side downloadable game code. Whoever scurries to redeem it first. There you go. Redeem at steam.com. If you do redeem that, let me know in the comments below. What else do we have here that might float my boat? I'm seeing a poster and a free rubber band. That'll come in handy. Certificate of authenticity. What is it? authenticating. Geek Fuel has issued this certificate to authenticate this limited edition print of the Legend Green Edition by Juan Muniz. Muniz? I don't know. Unfortunately, mine's a bit creased, which makes it even more limited edition, I guess. And then we get a t-shirt. What's going on there? It looks like we've got Superman, Batman, Wonder Woman, somebody else and then somebody else. <laughs> you know me, I like to make mine Marvel, so frankly, <laughs> DC, I can't wear that, it'll burn my flesh. I don't know, maybe I could use this as a rag to clean my windows or clean my car. People say, Glenn, why do you hate DC so much? And you know, to be honest, I don't, I love Marvel, that doesn't mean I hate DC. I just kind of have never got into it. But the DC don't stop there, as we've also got a Funko Mystery Mini. Wonder Woman, Batman, and Superman on the front there. There's Aquaman and um, Iron Man, Batman on one side, and then a couple of random blokes on the other. I guess maybe that's Bruce Wayne and Clark Kent with the specs on. You'd assume, right? And as is part of the course, it's a bag within a box. Now, I did touch on this last episode. It seems Mr. Snippity Snip has gone AWOL. I'm not sure where he's gone. If you have seen him, please let me know in the comments below. So until um, he reappears, I'm gonna have to use Mr. Stanley Knife to open this bag up. And we have Stan... Da -da 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 -da. Is it in focus? It's Superman. And then, okay. This is what was making it so heavy. It's a blooming book. The amazing, fantastic, incredible, a marvelous memoir, Stan Lee and Peter David. Peter David's one of my favorite comic writers. 
And this is in fact an illustrated graphic novel memoir of Stan Lee, I suppose. And better still, I've seen this in Tesco selling for actual money, so that's a good thing to have. But of course, Stan Lee, the infamous comic creator. Did I mention that? Not to be confused with the craft knife I use in Blind Bag Bonanza on occasion to open stuff up with. Yep, that's the sum of Geek Fuel. So let's sandwich into the middle one up box and leave for our grand finale T blocks. Batman versus Superman, it's more like Geek Fuel versus One Up Box. Who will win? Let me know in the comments below. Ooh. Oh, I like, I like. They're heroes in a half shell and they're green. When the trolls in the comments attack, these turtle boys don't cut no slack. <laughs> that was the sound effects of him cutting no slack, I guess. And red bandana, that means it's Raphael. Glenn Fact, actually Glenn Fact number one. I learned what crude men by the lyrics of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cartoon theme song. Because Raphael's cool but crude. I asked my dad, Dad, what does crude mean? He didn't know. So we looked it up in the dictionary together for a bit of father and son bonding over knowledge and Ninja Turtles. Glenn fact number two, as a weak hitty winkle, excited for Ninja Turtle action figures, running to the toy store, I was hit by a car. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing. I still bear the scars. And in fact, let me, um, if I roll up my trouser leg to show you the scar, actually, it seems my legs are too sexy and muscular to allow that. I'd um, pull my pants down, but YouTube have policies against stuff like that. So um, I'll, um, in post, I'll add a picture of my scar. Yep, so that was a toy hunting war wound. You know, I film these things and put them on YouTube. Can you imagine if in one of them I get hit by a car? It'd probably be good for views. Back to one up box and, oh blimey. I've got a collection of um, Batman versus Superman DC t-shirts now. I don't know if Wonder Woman's trying to break it up, either that or they're both just taking their frustration out on her instead. It definitely looks like Batman's just punched her in the face. Superman's about to punch her somewhere else. You know what? With these boxes, they've shipped from the US. So if you're in the US, they probably arrived in time to take advantage of your excitement for Batman versus Superman. They've taken a couple of weeks to reach to these British shores where I live. And um, now we all know the movie's a bit of a... Um... Oh goodness, there's a... It's a Batman, Superman and Wonder Woman pin. And then there's... What is this? A notepad? Ooh, maybe sticky notes. There you go. And then these are magnets, two halves of a halo helmet. Psh, I guess it's red versus blue. These verses, the theme here, these boxes usually have one. I'm gonna say yes, because that's what it says on this leaflet here, in fact. And then there's a pin badge, and then there's a shoelaces. So that's one up box. You can um, check out the links to sign up to these services yourselves in the description beneath this video, both Geek Fuel and One Up Box, and of course, where is it? T Blocks. Now we like to end on a cliffhanger with T Blocks to see just what's in here. Will I be extending my Breaking Bad t-shirt collection even further? Ooh, there's a comic. I love a comic. Oh goodness, it's Justice League. At least it's Justice League Europe. So while it's DC, they've at least continent-wise tailored it towards me. There's the obligatory Batman sticker. There's the obligatory Superman sticker. I'd say that they're being topical with Batman versus Superman, but if you watch these episodes, you know that they pack those in every month regardless. And then the T-shirt itself. Mm. Ooh. Yes, sexy and muscular legs, but not sexy and muscular arms, it seems. 
And what is it? Is it, oh, history? Is that the History Channel's logo? Um, okay. Gosh, more rags than I have things to clean with them in this episode. So that's that. By the way, this is episode 90 something or other. Episode 100 is approaching. Now, if you have any ideas of a special way I can commemorate my 100th blind bag bonanza, do let me know in the comments below. In the meantime, if you missed the previous episode, click that video to catch up. Give this video a big thumbs up and I hope to see you all next time. Mm, bye.